58 days. That's how long Cole Hosack has been missing after stopping in Dawson Creek for a quick visit on New Year's Eve. Imagine being his mum, Julie, or his friends and family, having no answers, no clues, and no substantive communication from authorities on what's going on to find him. Two local First Nations women, Renee Didier and Darylin Supernant, have also disappeared from Dawson Creek without a trace over the last year or so. Danny Poole, a young boy, been missing for almost eight years. These are all someone's family members. Cole's family, friends and supporters have been holding numerous search efforts looking for any information to find Cole and the others that are missing. But the frustration is obviously mounting and we need help. These families need hope. These families deserve answers. The levels of serious crime in my region has hit unprecedented levels over the last few years. We've never seen anything like this. It's actually crazy and people are getting afraid and they need to know that we are doing something about it. This should never happen anywhere, but for a small community like Dawson <coughs> Creek, frankly, this is getting scary. I do though want to thank the Attorney General and the Minister of Public Safety for meeting with myself and the Mayor of Dawson Creek last week, and I hope that that materializes into the much needed supports. My final plea, someone out there knows something. We need to give these families and their loved ones some hope. Please, if you have any information, call the RCMP or Crime Stoppers so we can give these families hope and give them the answers that they are begging for. Thank you.